Hey, Magic Legends community. I'm Steven Urcosa, the executive producer of Magic Legends, and welcome to my home office. We're gonna be taking a look at the state of development for Magic Legends, and we've got some exciting updates, announcements, and reveals throughout this video. So let's get to it. First, we held three 10-day closed alpha tests last year to gather feedback and make general improvements, and we're gonna hold another one in just a few weeks. I'd like to thank the nearly 100,000 testers for taking the time to play, participate in forum discussions, and submit survey responses. We've collected a pile of awesome data. These amazing community members that participated gave us some fantastic perspective. We were able to confirm that we were doing some things right, some things needed work, and the community actually came up with some ideas that were unexpected and are actually making it into the game. During development, we really wanted to lean into the card game by focusing all of our rewards as spells, artifacts, or currencies. Our translation was as literal as we could make it, but the player desire and player feedback pointed out that while these drops are super fun and change the way you play the game, they don't replace gear. With that, I'm excited to announce that thanks to your feedback, we're implementing a full equipment system into the game. You'll be collecting and upgrading equipment for your Planeswalker in addition to all the other rewards we were dropping before. We'll have more details very soon, but I want to let you know that we heard your feedback and this feature is now in flight. Based on player feedback, we've also made some other changes. Classes level almost 50% more quickly to encourage players to play every class in the game. Reward drops have increased across the board. We're smoothing out our onboarding experience so people feel more prepared to engage with their spells, the random hand, and the general flow of the game. We're doubling down on lore integration so the game feels like it's bursting at the seams with magic history. And we doubled the player count on our overworlds while simultaneously providing significantly more content to play on those overworlds. On top of all that, we've been working on loads of polish, bug fixes, and stability improvements to help make your gameplay experience as high quality as possible. Above and beyond our adjustments, we have a host of other new features that were inspired by your feedback. A per-region reputation system that rewards currencies, unique cosmetics, and a unique spell. A Planeswalker progression system that tracks the combined levels of all your Planeswalker classes and gives rewards and combat bonuses based on your progress. An additional difficulty mode to add challenges to players that want it, mythic and legendary world bosses throughout our overworlds, and we've added over 150 spells and 50 artifacts to the game, with more coming online every day. For a chance to experience some of these changes and be part of the community that will improve the game leading up to launch, our final closed alpha playtest will be starting up on January 28th with another huge group of players being invited to check out our latest content. Follow our socials to see previews of the new features and lots more cool stuff in the lead up to launch. As one final piece of news, I am thrilled to announce that Magic Legends will be live in open beta in March of this year. Thanks for watching our latest update, and I look forward to seeing you in the multiverse.